what is up, what is down, and what is all around as I spin this guy around and around. Um, this is Zatar and Master Dominus fused together. Um, if you follow the channel, maybe you saw the alt mode already. That's kind of cool, I thought. Um, and so this would be that bot mode basically reconfigured. It doesn't, you know, do a full smooth trans uh, transformation without taking it apart. But imagination, that's what it's for. Um, but yeah. This is pretty cool, right? And uh, lots of neat things. He looks like some elephant soldier because of the tusks over here. But maybe he's part of, like, Wu-Tang. He kind of has this vest action going on in yellow and black. Uh, I do wish he had a little bit of a better elbow bend because there's nothing here. And he just kind of has it here. But uh, it's all grave. It's all good AB. And, um, yeah, some beautiful asymmetry, though. And so I think it's really, really nice. The best part, actually, about this build is how these feet things connect, and uh, it's going to be really simple, but at the same time, it goes a long way, actually, for many other builds uh, as well, and uh, you'll, you'll, you'll be surprised. You'll be surprised at the little things that I'm amazed at, <laughs> but um, yeah, in terms of the back, this is kind of interesting, right? He has this kind of like Ghostbusters backpack thing, and it's plugged into the back behind his head, so it's kind of like a power source. And it's almost like there's those little, like, piston things popping out, uh, you know, because it needs to expel steam. And, yeah, to keep this, uh, what is it, Ka not kaiju, um, what are they called? Jaegers, yeah, uh, Jaegers. Yeah, keeping the Jaeger going, bruh. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, so let's, uh, let's go over how to make him. And I'll show you that really clever part that I talked about in the feed, so... This is a standard lower torso of the Zatar, the Brunt figure, but you got to swap the feet. I mean, normally you don't, you would want the ankles like this, but you got to swap the calf, the lower halves. And why you got to do that is so on one side it has a hole, and so you need to plug in this claw right over here. This other side does not have a hole. It has a weird little plastic bit that's used for the super gun piece, but so you obviously wouldn't be able to plug this in, right? And so what you're doing, though, is you are flipping the little claw around and then plugging it in into that hole right there. And it's a great fit. And the reason why I swapped the legs is when I look at it like this, I feel like the feet part don't look cool. You know what I mean? I want the yellow bit to be on the outside. And yeah, that looks better. So, and you can still pivot it, you know, and uh, yeah, so that's the bottom half. Clever, huh? Clever. Uh, this top part is pretty easy. Uh, all these pieces of paper flying around. Um, this is just a blurry uh, picture image. This is the, you know, the tail covering, right? The hip covering of MD and, oh man, all this paint's coming off. Um all his nice black matte paint is starting to uh, come off, but that's fine. These are toys, that's what they're for. Uh, and then we have the large MD leg plugged in with the foot side up over here. And there's a little peg over here, and you're going to plug in the small appendage, and that becomes this cool thumb, really nice. Yeah, you can see it right there. Thank you so much. And at the bottom, you can see that this is the other hand. It's like a claw almost, and then you just plug that on the outside. And boom, and he has this neat shield, you know, on his fist. That's so cool. Um, on this side over here, we have the MD Dino or uh, Mastodon face with the face part facing upward. This is the spine. That's the neck. Uh, and on the bottom, we have the Zatar top torso plugged in, drill bit and all. The pistol top goes in plugged in over here. And the battery pack thing that I was talking about earlier, it's kind of cool. It's one large MD leg that's like folded, but there's three pegs that come out of this Zatar back piece. And then you plug that in here, 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 and then cinched all of this together using the MD uh, waist piece. And so it's like, and yeah, so that battery pack is plugged in and it'll last for like as long as your phone does. Um, and there he goes. There he goes. Lots of great things to like about this guy. I really enjoyed making him. I hope you enjoyed this video. Oh no, how long has he been super blurry back there? Oh no. Story of my life. Uh, blurry vision. Yeah.
cool. I hope you like them. I really like this guy. Yeah. And um, yeah, the two bot stuff is kind of fun too. It constrains you in terms of uh, pieces and parts, but at the same time, I feel like it's more accessible uh, by everyday folk. Um, yeah. And in a, in a good way. Cool. All right. Adio. Uh, <laughs> adio. Adios. Bye-bye.